Becky. Hey Sam. Where are we going? Are we heading to Chain of Lagoon? I want to say Chain of Ponds, but that's... Why don't you want to say that's Adelaide? That's Adelaide. That's we used to go, we used to go there quite a bit. Yeah. We're cycling, Chain of Ponds. So that's anyway, Chain of Lagoons, it's around, what, 150 k's from Launceston yeah. and approximately 200 Sorry. from Hobart. Yeah. We've been there before and we had a, um, quite a successful fishing trip, didn't we? Salmon fishing, yeah. At Brilliant. least 30 good size Australian salmon. Got a good feed. So we're heading there again. Um, catch some more salmon, hopefully. Absolutely. So we um, popped into Tamar Marine here in Launceston and we have been informed that they are catching them. So good news because that's where we're going. And we are, well, we've got our King's uh, rooftop tents above us. So Becky and I are going to be spooning together tonight. Get started, Becky? Yeah. I've already uh, I'm one little spoon. No way, I'm little spoon. <laughs> Pack is a rock. I'll be big spoon. I'm the big sister. I'll be big spoon. I'll be warm tonight. <laughs> <laughs> So it's actually really hot. I've just had to run into the water and cool off. So nice and wet to keep me cool. Um, first cast, let's see how we go. High tide is not till just after six o'clock. So not an, there's no expectation for uh, a little while, but we've got a nice deep gutter in front and let's hope there's some salmon swimming in it. We've just hit the beach. I've cast in and now I am just waiting. It's absolutely beautiful down here. It's a lot warmer than I was anticipating. It's just so nice. There's hardly any wind. The sun is shining. We've got blue sky. It is incredible. So all we need now is the fish to come on the bite and I will be one happy camper. So we're down at the beach. Been here for about oh, an hour. I've caught a couple of salmon, one was about 30 centimetres. The other one, I don't know, but it has to be around the two kilo mark. It's beautiful down here. Uh, the girls, I think, I reckon they've caught a couple, but we're still a couple of hours off of sunset yet, so the best time's yet to come, but it's nice to know that they're here. And it's been a long time since I've caught a fish that big, and it felt really good bringing it up. Dug a nice little hole in the sand for my blue bait, keep it nice and cool and out of the sun. Cheers. I just caught a salmon, a little baby salmon on my bottom hook. So I'm just baiting up again. I'm using a half blue bait on a two gang hook. And then I'm just doing a half pinch on the top just to secure that bait. So hopefully I've heard that Becky down the other end has uh, just caught another big salmon. So. I'll give it another go here and see. If not, I'm moving down to where the big fish is.
go too far out here because um, it drops off deep pretty quickly. And a oh, nice big cast. Hold that line just to make sure there's no bites along the way. Lock that sinker in and voila. Let's see how we go. fish caught so we have a yummy dinner coming up the shaved chef will be frying up some salmon on the barbecue with a heap of Worcestershire sauce some salt and some lemon juice and some lemon pepper It doesn't feel big, but it's still a fish all the same. So I'm interested to see 
what, uh, what hook they've gone for. They've gone for the two gangs hook with the bait or the popper. And here it is right here. What have we got? Oh, it's a mullet. So we've caught ourselves a mullet. And I have to say that that is a decent sized mullet. It's taken the top bait that had a full filter on it. I'm getting bites, hold on. So, I have just caught 
a big salmon. I am so excited. It was so much fun to pull in. You can hear the drag peeling off and it was awesome. A big fish. It's been a couple hours down here and it's been worth it. It was pulling it in and it got right to the shoreline and it actually fell off the hook. And so I freaked out and ran down to the shoreline because I, there was a wave coming and that would really suck to have lost it right at the end. But it was a really good fight, a really good salmon. So it's now getting pretty close to high tide so hopefully we'll get a few more in. It's a really, the weather has really turned here, it's got quite cold. Um, got the jumper on, got the hand warmers, <laughs> get a bit more toasty but hopefully we've got some more salmon to come.
wanting to target Australian salmon. And not a bad bycatch, a pretty decent sized flathead.